Hi, I'm Minute from Boxcar Marketing with your one minute marketing tip. And today's tip is about how we examine a single URL in Google Analytics. So if we use the Google Merchandise Store as a demo account, then we can look at uh, that information. So again, we're looking for a single URL. And since we're talking about pages within our website under the report section, we're going to use the engagement report, pages and screens. Now, what happens is that typically you have a large number of pages on your website. So instead of tabbing across and searching for a particular page, if you know the URL, you can just paste it into the search at the top. So I'm gonna look for the FAQ section for the Canadian store. That's gonna narrow down to that single URL where you can examine just the metrics that are related to that. If you want to change from path to title, you can do that through the drop down. And if you wanted to add um, additional information, secondary dimensions, you could look at, for example, sources of traffic to that particular page. So first user source is going to tell you all about new users. So the source of traffic, the very first time people visit your website. Whereas session source or source medium, that's going to tell you the sources of traffic for all the sessions um, that came to that particular page. So if we click on that, it will add that secondary dimension to our report where we're able to compare the various traffic sources. Um, another option here instead of source, if you're running ad campaigns to a particular page and you're using UTM parameters, then you might want to use session campaign as a way to see was this a particular ad or a email newsletter. So if you're using UTM parameters, you might choose session campaign. But again, for most of your investigations, you are probably looking to use session source medium. I'm Nick from Boxcar Marketing, and that's your tip for today. Thanks. Bye.